guys I'm back with another tutorial we're gonna jump right into it I'm using my Ardell pomade in dark brown and I'm gonna just go fill in my brows get in these sparse hairs and make sure everything is in order and in the right space I'm gonna go in and just go in with those brows go over it I'm going to use my Toffee in LA Girl Pro and I'm just going to line out those brows. Gonna fill it in, keep filling it in. I go back both, you know, with the spoolie and I fill it in and I go around it and just fill it in. It just makes it so much better. I promise if you keep doing this, your brows are going to come out really, really nice. So that's what I'm doing, just blending that out. Blend, 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 blending that out. Using my Wet n Wild brush, it's a fluffy brush, just to, you know, balance everything out and blend it out at the same time. I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna do the same exact thing using my Ardell dark brown pomade just to fill up those piles a little bit. Bless you. Excuse me, girl. Ooh, that sneeze. I'm gonna go in and fill that out. Fill the brow and shape it. I love doing this step because I shape my brows like this. And I go in and out and I take my pencil and my spoolie and I just keep going while the concealer is there. When the concealer is there, it's already in space, it's already in shape. So by you doing that, I make it look really nice and neat and sharp. So I go in and out and I blend that concealer out. Keep blending, keep spooling, keep blending and spooling throughout the whole brow. Just keep blending and spooling, blend and spooling, blend and spooling. It really works. Now I'm gonna go in with my NYX. And I'm just put it all over my lid, all over my lid. My next space all over my lid and I'm gonna go in with my olive sand in the bin eye with my brown I'm gonna take the brown at the semi suit 9 palette I'm gonna take that dark brown and I'm gonna go in and put it all over the lid all over the lid put it all over that lid darken that out I'm gonna go in with that burgundy shade and blend out the top and just make it blend in together. That's my transition color. I'm gonna use that for that. I'm gonna just blend, 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 and keep blending out. Keep blending out. Then I'm gonna go, I forgot what brush this is. It's by a beat by quart brush. I love this brush because it's flat. And I'm gonna be cutting my crease a little bit. I love this brush because it's flat and it does what it's supposed to do love it love it I'm just gonna go out and blend it out some more blend that eye out a little bit more blend it out a little bit more and then I'm gonna go in my I believe what palette did I use I forgot I'm so sorry I'm gonna put everything down below what I used I believe this color is called Sonic I believe but I'm gonna put it in the description below sorry then I'm gonna go with a darker color in that same palette and put it right on the top then we're jumping into the foundation. Y'all done jumped everywhere, y'all. Going in with my Maybelline 360, my favorite foundation. I've been using this for years. It's a whole grail for the past three years. I've been using this foundation. So I'm going to spray with my setting spray. I'm going to go in and dab. And make sure you dab your foundation and don't, like, swipe it. And I'm going with my NYX concealer. I forgot the color of it, I believe. It's in Toffee, I believe. Just blend that out, blend, blend under those eyes, blend, blend it out. Blend it out, taking my olive sand, my Sasha Buttercup. I mix those two colors together because it gives it a nice tone for my skin tone. It's not too white and it's not too dark, it's right in the middle. So I love it. 
I look a mess. Look at this mustache, y'all. I'm telling you, this creasing. You will not have creasing when you do this. Smile lines. Nothing won't crack. It will come out seamlessly and flawless. Like, I promise you. No cracks over here. I don't leave my bacon time a lot. I just hurry up and swipe it off. So I don't believe in that little, that look that I see that I don't like. I'm going to spray my face again. I'm, I spray my face so much. Like, I'm going to spray with my clients. I spray, spray, spray. It's crazy. I'm going to go under with that same color that I used the first time on my leg. I'm going to go in under my eye just to give it some definition. I like doing this. So it could just match. It just looks good. Matches. Now, <laughs> this is my favorite part. I put my lashes and my bottom lashes off camera because it took a little bit of time. So I'm just going to highlight my brow bone. Highlight my brow bone. Highlight my cheeks. I love, oh my god, this highlight. I love this highlight. I'm just going to highlight everything down. Highlight my chin. Cupid's bow, tip of my nose, and look at that, we're done, look at that, we are done, please y'all, please like, comment, and subscribe, it'll mean a lot, you know, send me a comment of what you guys want to see, if it's hair and, you know, makeup related, love it, thank you guys, I can't wait to do more videos, thank you so much, thank you so much for watching, thank you guys.